The ambassador of Palestine to Nigeria, Abdullahi Shabwesh, has lamented that Western support has increased the humanitarian crisis in Gaza following the ongoing war between Israel and Palestine. Addressing a press conference in Abuja, Shawesh decried that after over 70 days into the war, it is far from over as he alleged many Western communities lending support to Israel against Palestine. The ambassador noted the death toll has surpassed 20,000 Palestinians with 54,000 injured and 4,000 jailed. In the Gaza enclave, the death toll has surpassed 20,000 Palestinians with 45,000 injured and 4,000 jailed. Additionally, nearly 6,000 people are still missing under the rubble and there is currently no way to reach out to them. 35 members of the rescue team and 135 international staff, mainly from UNRWA, have, have been killed. The envoy calls on the international community to adhere to December 12th General Assembly's resolution calling for an immediate ceasefire and protection of civilians as well as upholding legal and humanitarian obligations. However, some countries did not support the adoption of this resolution and some even blindly aligned themselves with the Israeli occupation voting against by voting against the resolution. This sent a clear message of their political support for the ongoing poachery against the poachery, poachery against the Palestinian innocent citizen. Among the thousands of loved ones we bear we also come to realize that international law has, no, has long been dead. The myth of the human, humanism, democracy, and the freedom of expression has dead, but for a long time we believe it was still alive and breathing. Meanwhile, the ambassador disclosed that even after the military aggression comes to an end, the damage done will be irreversible.